Blake, he just insisted on going outside. I tried to talk him, you know, trade places with him, but he said no. No. And it, Blake, get us up to date on what you think in terms of the winds this evening. Yeah, well, first, Matt, the main reason I wanted to be out here is because I love getting pelleted with ice pellets. I love the pain that uh, when it hits my face, it's everywhere. The ice pellets also tells me that we may be getting closer to switching over to freezing rain here in Grand Rapids. We were at sleet earlier now at these ice pellets. But let's first get you to the wind. The current wind speed, anywhere between 15 and 25 miles per hour, uh, gusting even higher than that. We're seeing some gusts approaching 30 to 35 miles per hour. It's been breezy throughout the day. This is going to become a bigger problem problem because as ice continues to accumulate on the power lines and trees, especially near and south of Grand Rapids, the chance for power outages goes up. If we step you through wind gusts overnight tonight, we could see some gusts approaching 40 miles per hour, especially towards uh, tomorrow afternoon. So that's when the most ice will be on a lot of our trees and power lines. And obviously that is of concern for at least parts of West Michigan. Again, it seems like we're getting closer to maybe making that transition. During the 4 o'clock show, we talked about how Grand Rapids may eventually get into solid freezing rain. This is one step closer. I might just stay out here for a few more minutes because I uh, love getting hit with ice pellets. But for now, I'll send it back to you in the studio. <laughs> All right, Blake. Thanks, Blake. <laughs>